Hi friends, welcome to YSH Santosh. In this video, I am going to cover the most important protected area for the prelims 2023 which is the Great Nicobar Biosphere Reserve. Guys, in this year's prelims examination, there is definitely going to be a question on this topic and if you watch this video completely, definitely you are going to mark that question correctly. Because this video will be the most comprehensive and the most analytical video on the topic. Guys, we will see each and every dimension of the Great Nicobar Biosphere Reserve and I am also going to give you the type of questions which can come on this topic. So let us begin guys. The first and foremost important point which you should know is where is this Great Nicobar Biosphere Reserve located. Okay, so you can see in the first column I have given you the location of the Biosphere Reserve. So it is located in the Great Nicobar Island which is the southernmost island of the Nicobar Island Archipelago. It is located further south of Kanyakumari and is closer to Myanmar and Sumatra than to mainland India. This is a very important fact. This is a very important fact because UPSC in the past years have framed questions on the distance between the Andaman Nicobar Islands with the mainland India and the Sumatra and Myanmar. So this is very important that it is closer to Myanmar and Sumatra than to mainland India. The second important fact which you should know is which river flows through this protected area. So you can see here the protected area has only one perennial river which is called the Galathea River. It originates in the Campbell National Park and flows all through the south towards the south through the Galathea National Park and its estuaries forming the nesting ground for great giant leatherback sea turtle, Oliver Ridley turtle and green sea turtle. So this is a very important fact that Galathea River which originates in the Campbell National Park and flows down south through the Galathea National Park and its estuaries forming an important nesting ground of great leatherback sea turtle, Oliver Ridley turtle and green sea turtle. So this means in this great Nicobar Biosphere Reserve, we also find these species. Guys, turtles are very important for the UPSC prelims examination 2023. You should know exactly which turtle is found where because I think this year turtles are a very important species for the prelims examination. Okay. Now let us see what kind of species are found in this great biosphere reserve. You can see here because this biosphere reserve is a biodiversity hotspot, biodiversity hotspot. So many endemic species, many endemic species and endangered species are found here. Okay, what do we mean by endemic? Means those species are okay found only in this area. So you can see here. Okay, endemic species and endangered species are found here like leatherback turtle, Oliver Ridley turtle, dugongs, Nicobar megapod, serpent eagle, saltwater crocodile, marine turtles, Nicobar tree shrew, which is endemic in the Nicobar, and we also find here Nicobar lion tailed macaw. This is very important. Nicobar lion tailed macaw which is a subspecies of crab eating macaw guys this species is schedule is in the schedule one schedule one of the wildlife act okay schedule one of the wildlife act and it is globally vulnerable status it has globally vulnerable status nicobar lion tailed macaw it is very 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 important species in this biosphere reserve and the other species which is very important is the Nicobar tree shrew which is endemic to this biosphere reserve and also the leatherback turtle which is also very important which is okay nesting in this area. Guys in this biosphere reserve okay there are two protected areas namely the Galathea Bay National Park and the Campbell Bay National Park. Guys, every biosphere reserve has protected area inside it. Okay, so in this protected, in this biosphere reserve, there are two protected areas, 
Galatia Bay National Park and the Campbell National Park. So UPSC tries to frame questions around this. So you should know this. Okay. Next. Okay. What kind of vegetation we are? Okay. We can find here. So we can see here, tropical wet evergreen forest is found in this. Okay. Biosphere reserve. Okay. There is a mountain called Mount Thulier, which is of the height 642 meter above the sea level. Guys, there are okay various kinds of mangroves vegetation also found in this Great Nicobar Biosphere Reserve. Apart from that, there are ferns, there are gymnosperms, there are lichens which are found here. Guys, lot of okay endemic species of plants are found in this Biosphere Reserve. So the word key word is endemic species and rare species, endemic and rare species, and ferns, lichens. Etc. Etc. Are the keyword which UPSC can use to frame questions. Further, in this biosphere reserve, we find two PVTGs, particularly vulnerable tribes. So you can see here, Mongoloid Shompen tribe is found in this biosphere reserve, and another Mongoloid tribe, which is the Nicobaris, are found in this Great Nicobar Biosphere Reserve. They can ask you. Which two tribes are found in this Great Nicobar Biosphere Reserve? Because UPSC, okay, has been asking questions. Okay, what kind of questions UPSC can ask from biosphere reserves? So UPSC will ask, okay, what are the protected areas inside that biosphere reserve? Second question, what are the species found in that biosphere reserve? Third, what are the rivers? What are the mountains? So we have seen here Mountain Thulier and River Galathea. Then they can ask you what are the different types which are found in that protected area, and then, okay, what kind of vegetation and climate is there in this biosphere reserve? So I hope I have covered this topic in detail, guys. This is the scientific way in which you prepare for the biosphere reserve. You can see here that I have prepared all the biosphere reserves in this table format. Okay, you can see. In this table format, you can see here. Okay, state, rivers flowing, flagship species, surrounding parks and national parks, vegetation and special features. You see, every detail of the national park scientifically arranged because UPSC frames questions. Okay, surrounding national parks and okay protected areas. UPSC frames questions on flagship species. UPSC frames question on rivers flowing. UPSC frames question on which states it is located. UPSC frames question regarding vegetation. UPSC frames question regarding special features. For example, this you can see this. Okay, this biosphere reserve is very special. Why? Because we have. Okay, this is a biodiversity hotspot, and we have lot of. Okay, we have lot of. Okay, uh, endemic and we have lot of endemic species and endangered species found in this. Biosphere reserve. So this biosphere reserve is very, very, very important. And I hope this video, please note down of note down this. And if you want, okay, this table, you can contact me through my Telegram. Okay, I'll be giving you this table also. Thank you guys. Bye bye. Take care.